What's up cousins? In this video I'm going to teach you how to style and theme your Android applications using Jetpack Compose. It will only take a few minutes and everything is written in Kotlin. Let's get started. First we will set up colors. I have created a file called color.kt. The name doesn't matter but it contains these color classes here. You can either use a predefined constant or supply an ARGB hex value. Let me explain how to read and write these values. The first two characters tell the compiler that this is a hexadecimal number. The next two characters define the alpha or transparency as a percentage in hex. The remaining pairs are the red, green, and blue values again in hex. Next, we will set up our font styles or typography as it's referred to. You can create a typography class which allows you to set up some predefined values which Compose can use when we create the theme. I also have some other text style classes floating around top level for when I need them. Creating the theme is super easy. Here I have defined two color palettes for light and dark themes. If you do not know what a composable is, you need to watch my video explaining that topic. The only new idea here is that we are making a call to is system in dark theme. Dark theme is a mode the user can select in their settings on more recent versions of Android. We use this boolean to select for a light or dark color palette using a ternary or conditional assignment expression. Using your theme is also super easy. For beginners, my suggestion is to place it inside of the set content call or at least at the top level of your Compose hierarchy, any composables you place inside of your theme will inherit the themes and styles, so that is all you have to do. As a bonus tip, if you want to apply a custom style to a text composable, use the style default argument. Text style happens to have its own copy function in case you need to tweak things a little bit. That's it for this tutorial. If you learned something, like, subscribe, and follow me on your preferred social media networks. Peace out, cousins.